shortly tell us uh, who you are and a few sentences about your campaign. Yeah, I am Stina Lindblad, the vice chairman of uh, Studiefremjandet, who is an um, educational organization that gathers people that loves animals, nature and also culture. And our campaign is, our climate heart goes to Tusen Trädgårdar, who is a campaign that uh, gathers people who loves gardening and they are showing their gardens to others to inspire them and teach them and, and uh, to uh, make them uh, enjoy flowers but also be gardeners themselves. So this is um, promoting the uh, biodiversity and that is why we want to give them the climate heart today. So uh, um, Gun Gunnel Karlsson from um, yeah. Gunnel Karlsson who started the initiative uh, and um, she is getting the heart but also everyone who has participated in the Tusen Trädgårdar gets climate love from Studio Fremjandet. So why do you feel this issue is so important to you? Because biodiversity is the biggest uh, problem we have right now um, besides the climate. Climate is taking a lot of um, media attention and so on right now but um, that um, species are dying uh, rapidly right now. So that is why it's so important to, to lift this issue with biodiversity. And we can't get it back. It, it's unreversible. So, If you can dream, what are your highest hopes for this? Campaign? My highest hope is that um, this gardening will be some movement in municipalities' way of um, using their green areas uh, could be more like um, to promote biodiversity. Not so much uh, moving, moving the lawn, but uh, very much uh, growing plants and different kinds of species and to attract insects and pollinators. So it, it, it both uh, private persons and uh, municipalities and how we how we use the green areas in the community. Uh, what do you think about this way, doing a climate campaign to influence people? I think it's really good. It's global because it's uh, on the internet and it's really good that so many different campaigns are in the same um, platform. So you can find very much good ideas. So it's really spreading love and, and spreading knowledge. Uh, so I like it really much and it's, it's very good that we can have influence from all over the world. On the big stage we can listen to, to, to people from all over the world and that's really interesting. It's the new way of campaigning I think. And finally for everyone out there thinking about starting their own climate campaign, what would you like to say to them? Just do it. <laughs> it's easy. And I mean, with social media, you just tell everyone what you think and, and talk to each other on social media or, or in real life. And let them know what you think and how you think the world should change. And it will change.